Hi and welcome. In this video, we are going to see about penalty shootout question from Cook of February 2020 Code Chef. Okay, so let's understand the problem first and then we will move on to the logic, which is a pretty simple logic. So, in this particular question, team A and B are having a penalty shootout to decide which is the winner of a football match. Each team take n shots. Okay, so each team is taking n number of shots. And the team with the highest number of score obviously wins the game. And after taking all the two and shots, if both the teams have the same score, then it is a draw. Okay. The two teams take shot alternatively. Alternatively, first A will take, then B, then A, then B, and so on. Okay. Now the next point is even though all two and shots are taken, the result of the shootout is often known earlier. Okay. Example: If a team, if team A has already scored n minus one goals and team B has missed at least two shots, then A is definitely the winner. What is the meaning of this? For example, if you have a penalty shootout, okay, and A scores a goal, B does not, A scores a goal, B also scores, A does not score the goal, B scores the goal, okay. So this is A, this is B, this is C, so this is A again, then B, then A again, then B, okay, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, fine. So each team has three shots. So total we have six shots, two into n. Fine. Now can we know directly that which team will win? For example, if I just change it here to zero, then A will have a one shot. Okay. B is having zero point. Then A has two points and B is having zero points. At this particular point, at this particular point, can we tell that A won? How can we tell that A win at this particular point? Because after this, B has just one chance left. Okay, B has just a single chance left. Okay. But the difference between these two is greater than this chance. The difference between these two is greater than this chance. Okay, there is a difference of two goals, and B has only one chance left. Okay, even if he scores, this goal difference will never be completed. Okay, so therefore, at this point, we can say that A win. So what the question is asking us to do is question is asking us to tell that at which particular point you can definitely say whether a1 b1 or it is a draw okay that is the whole particular question now let's just take some examples uh, the logic is also pretty straightforward we have actually discussed the logic for this particular one so let's now do this so let's just form the logic so a and b both have uh, initially let's say na five chances and b also have five chances correct in the first chance a scores a goal so let's uh, keep it count a scores a goal okay count b b also scores a goal correct b also scores a goal fine so at this particular point can we say uh, who is the winner or is it a draw so they are both equal there is no difference so we cannot say anything right now at count three a scores a goal but b doesn't so can this particular point can we say at count three can we say when there is two one uh, can we say that a win so can we say that the difference is nothing but just one okay the difference is nothing but one and b has how many chances left b still has four chances left he has three chances and b has four chances if b scores for all chances and three and a does not score so that means b will win so at this point we cannot say who is winning okay at fourth chance b does not score a goal so now three chances are left for both of them at fifth a scores a goal so a become three there are two chances left for a okay at this point can we say uh, a win so at this point the difference is of two okay the difference is of two and in this particular have b still have how many chances left b still have three chances left b score is one and b still have three chances left so b final score can become four okay and a can remain just at three so b can win still or there can be a draw also so we do not know at this point we do not know at this point now come here at six b will score so now two chances are remaining for b at this point can we say who win so at this point b has two chances left so he can go above a okay or a can remain above b we do not know anything right now at this particular point now a has just one chance left and this is the case so can b still go above a yes b can go at this particular point b will increase to three okay can we say it is a draw no both have still one one chance left we cannot say it is a draw now at nine a does not score anything okay so zero chance left for a can we say at this point that b is win no we cannot say that b will win because right now it is a draw if b does not score at 10th then it will remain a draw okay so we cannot say anything at this point also at 10 b became four 
okay now the difference is one is any chance left for a no so no cannot cover so a cannot cover this distance so b wins okay now where at this at which point we know that b definitely won at the tenth point so for this test case the answer is nothing but 10 so i hope you understood this so at each and every point we will simply calculate what is the current score of a what is the current score of b okay and we will see can the uh, can b or a how many chances are left can they match this particular score or not okay it's very simple fine so if uh, a score is nothing but 2 and b score is nothing but 1 and b chances are left are 3 so is 2 greater than 3 plus 1 no 2 is not greater than 3 plus 1 okay that means b can still overtake 2 b can still overtake a at this particular point we cannot say anything but if a is 4 and b is 1 and chances of b remaining are just 2 so 4 is greater than 2 plus 1 that means b whatever a ha happens to a b cannot cover this much distance b cannot cover this much distance okay there is not any possibility of b catching up to a therefore at this particular point we can say that yes a is winning and we can stop our program okay so this is the particular logic for this question okay just calculate the values of a calculate each at each point calculate the value of a calculate the value of b okay now just calculate this point whether how many chances are remaining see that we we already have the variables for that how many chances are remaining that many chances plus the current score okay if we can go that many chances plus the current score okay if that they are enough then we cannot say at this particular point who is the winner but if they are not enough then we have to get the final answer that we have to print that yes at this stage we know who is the winner okay so let's just see the code it is a very straightforward code so in this code uh, we have taken n a string input fine then a chance a chance b both are initialized with n short a short b to know at this particular point what is the value of a and what is the value of b the score of a score of b fine a loop running from 0 to less than 2n if it is an even that means a is short and if it is odd that means b is currently uh, scoring or b is currently taking the shot okay so we will if we will increment the shot if it is one then it will be incremented by one if it is zero then it will be incremented by zero and the chance of a will decrease if it is of b chance then chance of b will decrease now we will just see this short a is greater than short b plus chance b or we can it is same we can do short a we can find the difference between a and b and we will compare it with the chances left for b okay find the difference between b and a and compare it with the chances left for a fine print i plus one i plus one because we are starting with the zeroth index and finally if the short a equals to short b and and we are at the last position and there is no difference the difference is zero then at that particular point we will simply tell it is that means it is a draw and we will print i plus one where we do not have to print who won a b or draw we just have to print the point at which we know that who is winning okay so this is the whole code for this particular case a very straightforward question we just need to find the difference and compare it with the chance left okay thank you